Ah, oh, dude. I didn't. I didn't think he was gonna give us that kind of an option. Take her off my arm. Not exactly a handicap ramp. No, no, it's not. We're gonna have to climb as quiet as we can. Can you handle that? Yeah. Get going. I mean, it'd be difficult to climb that ladder one arm, but I don't think it's impossible. Uh, you okay down there? Quiet, remember? It's no oh, big God. deal. Uh, another arm. Just left get in the way. Stick. Shit. Okay. Just hold up. I'm gonna have to grab onto something right now. I don't like this camera angle at all. How's he doing like four rungs at a time? What? Oh my god, what? Oh shit. Shit! Damn. Everything okay up there? I just about shit my pants, but yeah. <laughs> it's like lagging, I don't even know what's going on. Oh man. See, I don't know if I like this with him not having an arm, but I like it for the fact that he's not going to turn into a zombie, at least, I would think. No help. <laughs> Remember when Savannah was empty? Oh, way back then. Like six hours ago? A lot's happened in the meantime. You wanna talk about what happened back there? You lost a lot of blood. If you find yourself getting winded or worse, you gotta let me know. Well, it wasn't my favorite hand anyway. Well, you haven't lost your spirit. Seriously, though. Don't treat me any different. I got one goal, you hear me? Yeah, pal. I do. Clementine's out there somewhere. Gobbled up in all of that. We'll get to her, Lee. We'll do whatever we have to. I think step one is to pick a direction. Back towards the mansion is my vote. I'm all turned around, though. It's between us and River Street, so we can stop if we have to. Retrace our steps, maybe. And they get going towards the hotel where Clem's parents were staying. Okay. We get down and we find a little girl out there. Right, pal? Now, let's get our bearings. Mmm, look at sign. Kind of unnecessary looking ladder, how about that? It's an extension ladder. Oh, thanks. I can't go over that way, apparently. This down thing for. Oh, to leave. I didn't want to do that. I wanted to look at it. <laughs> That's a bell tower. Like the ones Molly used to draw the walkers around the city. Alright, obviously I need to use the ladder to get over there, so. Give me that ladder. Whoa, you need some help with that? I got it.
Damn it. Bell Tower? Yeah. Could buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You think you should be the one to go? Let me do it. No. If we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? If anything happens death. to me, you're the only chance she's got. Be careful. Fuck that, I would have Kenny do it. <laughs> Alright. I guess we're gonna do this with one arm. Why the hell are we letting the one arm guy do all the high risk maneuvers? Because the one arm guy insists. Now shut up about it. That thing looks a little rickety. Maybe keep that shit to yourself next time? Yep. I think he could like hold it steady or something. Oh shit. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Jesus, you all right? Yeah, I'm fine. I was wishing I had my other hand. No kidding. Try to find another way out. I think I gotta pull it and then go, right? Yeah, it only makes sense. That did the trick, pal! Now get back here! Can I jump? I think I have to jump. There's no way back. You can make it. It ain't that far. Oh shit. You got this. You got this, motherfucker. He's <laughs> gonna lose an arm and a leg after he breaks it. Me up, Kenny. Fucking dick. Good goddamn leap, pal. Let's get the hell off this roof. We just magically find a staircase to the, to the streets. Take it to the streets. What the so fuck? The Vernon, his entire crew, they took the boat. No fucking way! They jumped us. They didn't have Clementine. They took the boat and locked us in here. Holy the fuck. invalids? Their actions uh, contradict your characterization, but yeah, the invalids. They fucked us! He's right. They're not invalids. They're just people. People who've been dealing with shitty situations even longer than we have. No wonder they got the jump on us. I don't give a fuck if their make-a-wish was a fucking boat ride. When I find them, I'm gonna rip their throats out. We'll never find them. We would have done the same. Not like this. We wouldn't leave good people to rot. We've taken food. We've killed to survive. What's the difference? It's different. What the hell happened to you? Cut it off. Seriously? 
I was bitten. What? It was an accident. A small, stupid thing. But yeah. Before we split up? Yes. You fucker! God, we would have gone with you! I lived through it, which is a start. And, well, I... I thought it might save my life. I was lucky to get bit down on the wrist, far from anything important. But who knows? Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine, and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. I don't want to go back out there again. Then don't. Go your own way. You're every man for himself until you and your boyfriend actually need something. You wouldn't have had a boat to lose without us. So shove it, okay? Everyone keep it together. Nothing has changed, has it? Nothing has changed? I mean immediately. We stay the course. Don't turn on each other. We can do this in the yard. 